I'm Dennis Velasky. I'm the general manager of Finochi Water and Drainage District. And we are here now at a uh, reverse osmosis plant that is being operated now as a pilot plant to remove selenium uh, from some surface water. Where does the water come from and why are you removing it? The water comes from about 90,000 acres of fertile farm ground, uh, what we refer to as the grassland basin drainage area. And uh, historically this ground has uh, drained water to the San Joaquin River, only subsurface water. This water has never gone to Ketchison, it has always gone to the San Joaquin River. Our goal is to uh, continue to drain this ground, however, to cease discharge into the San Joaquin River. And one of the way, or some of the ways that we do that is through uh, a reuse area where we use this saline water to grow salt tolerant crops, and then ultimately we send it here for its final treatment stage. And uh, as I was saying earlier, uh, I'm, I'm extremely excited to say today that off of the 90,000 acres, we are discharging about one cubic foot per second to the San Joaquin River. That's uh, less than an acre foot of water off of 90,000 acres. And this has been a long process, Dennis. Tell us how long it's been. Yeah, this process actually started back in 1985, uh, shortly after we had uh, the issues with Kesterson. All of that kind of impacted us because we did have selenium in our drain water. So we started what we call the drainage management program. And uh, the first phase of that was to improve all of our irrigation techniques. And then uh, our second uh, stage of that was to uh, develop a reuse area where we could take this saline water and use it on salt tolerant crops. And, I, and I'm really uh, pleased to say that our salt tolerant crops have been uh, a fantastic uh, source of revenue for the dairy, uh, from the dairy industry because of the Jose Tall wheatgrass and because of our pistachios.